Right now on News 12 New Jersey, the investigation continues into what caused an explosion at a Bergen County Animal Hospital. OSHA has gotten involved in that probe. Three people were injured, 60 animals displaced, and you can see the damage in these pictures taken inside that were caused by that blast. The explosion took place just before noon at the Oradell Animal Hospital on Winters Avenue in Paramus. And that's where we find News 12 New Jersey's Rick Holmes. He's on the scene. He's been there all day and has more on what's been a frightening day for pet owners. Rick? Absolutely. And tonight the hospital is on generator power, but that is only to power their servers. There are 150 employees and another 50 doctors that work out of this office. It was a busy Friday, but just before noon, an explosion took out some of the interior walls. I was at the opposite end of the building, and it sounded to me like something fell on the roof of the building, like a helicopter crashed or something. The jarring explosion sent people frantically searching for their pets. A look at the photos from inside show the damage. Walls from three or four rooms blown out in a cloud of dust. One operation on a dog even had to be completed in the parking lot as people and pets evacuated the hospital. Pretty challenging. Fortunately, it was just the very, I believe it was just closing the, the skin. I believe the surgery, the main part of the surgery was completed. The explosion sent a rush of pet owners headed toward the hospital. People like Cheryl Schwartz and Justin DiGennaro, who had just picked up Maddie, a Maltese Yorkie mix from surgery. You're worried enough about your, uh, your pet when they're going into surgery, so it's, it's even more nerve wracking when they come out and they're okay and then something like this happens. The pets and staff are all accounted for tonight. The cause of the explosion is believed to be from an MRI machine that was being disassembled. Three workers servicing the machine required medical attention. One is in critical condition. The gas that, that is in the MRI machine is helium. Right. And if that heats up rapidly, expands rapidly, it could cause an explosion. So that's, that's our temporary thought as to what, what, what happened. And of those three workers that required medical attention, one was in critical condition with a broken leg, also injuries to his torso. We found out tonight that he made it through surgery and he is expected to survive. As for the uh, hospital here, the Oradell Hospital, their Fort Lee location will be taking care of their most critical cases over the next one to two weeks. That's how long they expect this facility to be closed at least. That's the latest here in Paramus. Rick Holmes, News 12, New Jersey.